I'm just sitting here and I thought I would show you guys my face mask. This is the Peter Thomas Roth Rose Stem Cell Bio Repair Gel Mask. So I'm just going to keep it on for um, 20 minutes, something like that. Yeah, it says 10 minutes. I'll keep it on a little extra. Uh, why I wrote don't touch on the bottom like somebody left his beyond me. And I just washed my face with um the Lush Cosmetics um 7 to 3. I'll show you guys when I go back in the bathroom. And my hair got wet. I just got the bath. My hair got wet. And I just got my Sephora order. I got a little nervous because, like, the guy put the package in front of the door but didn't ring the doorbell. And I'm like, you know, for a second I got gas. You know, yesterday was Valentine's Day. I thought maybe somebody got me something. <laughs> Whatever. So I got the Fenty Skin Butter Drop. This is the one that has the glistening stuff in it. And then I blind bought this Nest New York Sun Kiss Hibiscus because I really like the... Um, I really like the golden nectar, so I want to get the full size of this. But I want to wait till I finish. Um, but this was eighty four dollars for the two instead of one ten. So I was like, let me just get that. I'm gonna get this in golden nest too, so it doesn't make sense to have two roller balls. So I'm just like, let me finish this and then I'll buy that. And then I picked two samples. So I like drunk elephant, so I got the drunk elephant um, TLC Sakura baby facial. And then it comes with a sample of the Virgin Marula Luxury Face Oil. So I'm not going to use them today. Um, I'll probably use them like this weekend. And then I got the sample of the Skylar Vanilla Sky because I have a sample of the Skylar Peach Fields, which smells a sample with roller, whatever, travel spray. This smells really good. And so I wanted to try the Vanilla Sky and Baby. We loves it there. We love it there. So, okay, the Skylar Vanilla Sky is rich, creamy, warm, cappuccino, pure vanilla, caramelized cedar. That like sweetness was just like, ooh, everything. But this, this sun kiss hibiscus, this was a straight blind buy. I never smelled it before. I just figured that. You know what? Hibiscus sounds good. Sunkiss sounds bright and refreshing. I should go with this. I really like how the bottle looks. It looks so pretty. Um, so oh man, it just oh, it smells really good. And like these fragrances don't really have like a lot of notes. So let me look it up. Um, I want to buy the Discovery set for the, um, there's a black-owned fragrance, the world of Chris something, Chris Collins, but they don't have the Discovery set available, which is very annoying. So this is Sunkissed. Okay, here it goes. So I could look at the notes. The notes are Frangipani, Orange Blossom, and Golden Amber. Um, it says, inspired by the allure of the voodoo queen hibiscus, this radiant solar floral taps into the warmth of golden amber to capture the luminosity of the sun. Layers of classic white florals and frangipani, and frangipani, a tropical floral with a creamy coconut accord, complete this fragrance and wraps you in bliss. <clears throat> Definitely given that. It smells really, really good. It smells really, really good. I wonder how this is gonna be in like a spring summer when it heats up on my body. It's gonna smell amazing. Cause matter of fact, let me. I don't know why I'm not opening it. The packaging is just so pretty. Like look at how the detail and like the flowers. Like I wanna, I wanna cut this one out and like use it in my notebook. It's so pretty. So, we'll edit that out. So, just pop the top. It 
I'm just gonna spray it. Oh, it just smells so good. It smells like, like not, like it smells really sweet, but in a warm way. Like the, what is it? Amber, that golden amber is like really like captivating. It's like, <clears throat> it makes it, it makes it, uh, it just smells really good. It gives it like a, not subtlety. I'm trying to find the right word. Like it doesn't give it, doesn't make it subtle. It makes it like, like not as sweet as I know it could be, but sweet. Like, I'm not making sense, am I? It's okay. It's okay. I'm looking at my toes trying to make sure that like they look okay. There's no like extra dead skin anywhere. I'm actually about I rub my my whole body with this fancy um with this like fancy stuff and I'm about to rub my feet with it too. This fancy feels so good and I like the little glistening like um the little glistening things. <laughs> glistening things. The little shiny things. I like that. So I'm debating if I should order another one because this is like limited edition or or if I should order the original. I feel like the original is always going to be there. So I'm probably going to order another one um, just because it's not going to be available. So now I'm going to wash my face and put my wig down. <laughs> put my hair down because I look like a crackhead. Um, and I just use these little sponges. So this is the seven to 10. This is what it looks like when you first buy it. And this is what it looks like, like when you use it, it like you use it down to nothing. So. Yeah, just have that. And then I'm gonna moisturize my skin after what am I going to use to moisturize my skin is the question. I have like this jar, box jar of samples that I've gotten. Like, so, okay, like this is a cleanser. So usually I only keep like moisturizers in here. So I know what's what. This is... This is a revitalizing serum from Chanel. I don't know if that's moisturizer or not. I have to look it up. Then I have my fancy skin primer, which I have this halo, but I feel like, I feel like it, um, I feel like it leaves like a layer on my skin because it's beeswax. I don't know if it should be like only worn inside or under makeup. It's like really thick, which I kind of like, but I feel like sometimes it can make my skin feel like. There's something called Fortuna Skin. Because it's a bi-phase moisturizing oil. Oh, this is $125. Um, defeats dryness, dull skin, and daily pollutants with this innovative bi-face oil. Once shaken to combine botanically infused olive oil and nutrient-rich olive leaf water, visibly plump, protect, and replenish your skin. Moisture barrier takes the skin glowing. Okay. After cleansing, toning, misting, serums, creams, and before SPF. So, I put that on after I put on the moisturizer. Okay. Other thing, and it's called the Rich Cream from Augustus Bader. So, $190. What am I? <laughs> This is moisturizer, and I have two of them. Hopefully, I can only use I only use one on my face, but at the price point of two hundred ninety dollars, it is a rich cream. A while ago, I had received like this bag from Berta Goodman, and it's so cute. It's so pretty. I'm scared to even use it for anything, and it came with like a bunch of like samples. I'm just gonna wash this off. The rich bitch. <laughs> I'm going to use the Rich Cream with TFC8, and then I'm going to use the Eye Cream with TFC8. Because I hope I don't like these products that much that I want to purchase them. Wow, it's, it's 
so cute. is really in here 1.0.1 fluid ounce water to wash off my face with a sponge because i don't want to get it on my eye and like this this um mask is just used to like clean my clean my not clean my skin but just like replump my skin like Throughout the winter is when I really use it when my skin is like really, really, really dry. So it's like my skin feels hydrated right now. Feels plump. They have like other ones. They have like a cucumber one. They have like a 24 karat gold one. They have a clay one. But lately, my skin just been feeling like so dry. So me personally, when I use this overnight, it makes my skin feel weird. I get like little red bumps. They go away in like 20, 30 minutes after I wake up and wash my face. But it's kind of weird. So I just use it for like a quick mask. Like the most I keep it on for is like half an hour. My, did you hear the weird noises? My dog is like laying down right behind me, making these weird noises as he always does. I don't even like he's asleep either. He's fully awake. See, now he knows I'm talking about him. I feel like he does it on purpose. Honestly. I need to start giving him like something like for his skin too. So I'm just trying to see if I left any anywhere. It feels like there's like build up right here. Not a lot, but enough. So I really like, so I had tried that um, Moon Cosmetics. I had finally used the stuff that I bought from that girl and my skin immediately started breaking out, which is crazy because I don't break out. So I gave it to, I think my hairstylist or somebody. The only thing I use is the oil. She has like another line out too, um, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think the only thing I would buy from her is the oil, like the moisturizer, that's it. Cause that's all I trust her with. <clears throat> um, yeah, some people could do that double oil cleansing thing. I'm not one of those people, apparently. So, uh, try it off my hands. So, use an upward sweeping motions. Okay. Well, Jesus, I'm trying to figure it out. Okay. Upward. That was downward. Whatever. We're just going to put it on first and then figure out what is what. I need my nail, though. Okay. So, upward. Oh. It feels nice. It doesn't. It smells like makeup, like. It smells like makeup from, I don't know, one of those stores that I shouldn't throw money in. It says you can get the deglige. So I'm gonna get that too. I don't like putting moisturizers and like certain creams on my tattoo because I don't want it to fade. <laughs> um, Wow, I'm so angry right now, I like it. <laughs> I like it, y'all, and I still have some left in my sample. Oh, too much, too much. Okay, I guess guess we gotta get the neck. <sighs> oh, don't forget the, the nose. Underneath my nose ring. Underneath my nose ring is really dry. 
Um, this feels amazing. <laughs> no wonder it's 209. Oh my God, I have my skin as I felt like this in a couple days, in a couple weeks. I feel like super moisturized. Now, it probably could have just been the rose thing, you know, because that's like rebuilding, helping rebuild. I still have some in here. We're not going to waste that. We're going to hold on to that for another day. Because $290 on some cream is kind of crazy. I got that at Nima Marcus. I'm going to see if they have the cream at Bloomingdale's. This feels really, really good. I'm not going to lie. Let's try the eye cream. Okay. I know you don't need a lot of eye cream. Feels very nice. Very nice. I'm not even gonna lie. Just because my skin's been really dry, I am gonna put this for tuna oil thing on. My hands are greasy, and how am I going to open it? Piece of tissue. Okay, I'm just going to use like one, two, three. Oh. I'm going to do the same sweeping upwards motion. Oh, this feels nice too. Um, I'm gonna use this like for the rest of the week and see how I feel. Cause I have two samples of the cream, the rich cream. And if I could use today's Wednesday, so Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. <clears throat> that means I have enough left for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We're gonna be scraping, op cutting open the thing, the plastic, and scraping it on my face. Well, I feel really hydrated right now. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I feel like my skin feels so good. Oh Jesus! Don't like the expensive cream. Gosh. Lip balm. It's like the one you. Let's see how much this lip balm is. I'm scared to even look. <laughs> I'm scared to even look. The oil was how much? Um, what is this? Dr. Barbara Sturm lip balm. This lip balm is $55. Not for this size, obviously. This side is like, oh yeah, we're, we're prim and proper. And this side is like, party! I'm just gonna let it dry. And then tonight I'll like press my hair out. So I'm about to edit. Yeah, I'm about to edit and try to figure out how I'm going to afford this cream. I really like the way this lip balm feels. I tried it on the other day, and I was like, ooh, this is busty. And it feels like slip. Like, my lips feel slip. I have this candle that I don't want to light from Casa Luna called Clarity. Grapefruit ginger. It smells so good. And I also have the diffuser. So the diffuser is by my bed. And then I have plugins in my bathroom. If you see my other video, you know this is my new fragrance. This smells amazing. I spray my sheets. And I'm drinking a Red Bull, which I shouldn't be doing. So I'm laying here. Definitely not going to put any clothes on. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I'm going to journal for about like 30 minutes. 
I'm going to find the prices. We'll find where's the best place to buy these creams and this oil from. Uh, I have a gift card with Bergdorf for a hundred dollars. Still haven't used it. I was gonna use it on a fragrance. I need to, you see those bins, that little bin that I showed you? I need to go get another one, probably like a green one or a pink one from like Michael's. And I need to put like, probably a few of them, maybe like three. I need to label one cleansers. I need, excuse me. I need to label one for cleansers, one for moisturizers and oils, and then one for lip products and one for hair products. Like so I could um, separate my samples because underneath my sink is just like kind of like a mess. <coughs> wow, I really like the way my skin feels. It even is drying. But my skin doesn't feel dry like I was been feeling the past couple days. So I know this definitely helped because this is amazing. As you can see, I'm like halfway done with it. I'll definitely buy another one when I'm done from Sephora. Get this from Sephora. Okay, let me edit my video.